All right, guys. So we got this little blizzard thing. I guess it's like the last storm we're gonna get. Maybe there'll be like another one with flurries, but it's it's really should be about the end of winter right about now. So it's probably the last little storm we're gonna get. And I happen to have a duty of working third shift for tonight, so I get to drive through it in the night. And it's going probably about as strong as it's been going. Man, we haven't really been getting a whole uh, strength of it, I guess you could say. I mean, it's been strongest down south of us, but still getting it nonetheless. So, hope I see or have an interesting drive, or at least me, because I'm the one driving and you're just on your computer watching this. <laughs> so far it's not too bad, but you know. sleeping all day, so I really didn't see it come in, but I guess it was raining first, and it starts snowing, so it's probably really icy. Yeah, it doesn't look like a snowplow came through. Yeah, I still got grip somewhat. Here, nope. I don't, don't want to try to get too loud so you can't hear shit.
right here. Holy crap. Stopping the wind from blowing, it's just allowing the snow to build up. It should clear up right up here where there's fields. <laughs> so far, my truck's handling it really well. If I never got this new axle with this lodger and winter tires, it really wouldn't matter how much weight I had in the back. I would have just been stuck behind the driveway still. Most of that's due from the really bad tires. Tires. I normally have are really only good for dry conditions. Even in the wet, they slip. They're just I'd really like to get them replaced, but I think I'm just going to use them for this one last summer into fall. And then I'll see how much I can get out of the rims. <laughs> That's only an if. I'll probably just set up put some new tires on those rims because I have a ton of money. Yeah, see, that just cleared up really well, actually. I think they maybe got a plow from here. Or maybe it's just... Uh, kind of doesn't look like a plow, maybe I can't do it. Don't see anything laying on the sides. Yeah, maybe not. No. Just let the snow here go. Upgrade with the new tires and the axle was is totally worth it. I wouldn't be able to get through all this. It's not totally like foolproof, you know. You can still easily get stuck, but it's just so much better now.
maybe it could be a brake issue because every time we played around the blade brakes, it got at least a little bit wider. So maybe something's only not to do with the rear at all. And I know there's something busted in the brakes because I'm feeling a grind in my pedal sometimes. It's an adjuster. You can sometimes feel it stuck on. The truck's kind of like be lurching forward because the brakes trying to hold it.
day. Finally got out of work at a stay at 652. Snow plows come through, but it's still slick, so still got a video probably for you.
county line. Stop plowing, guys. The county line. <laughs> because uh, the plow street is actually a street that really badly needs to be paved but never gets repaved and this unplowed street is well maintained except not plowed. <laughs> oh well this is where the Grand Rapids is in this county so I'm pretty sure they're all stuck there. Never to, never to escape until tomorrow at least.
a different beast altogether.